Welcome to next-gen Tesla Elon Musk's Tesla bot. Officially known as Optimus, is steadily moving closer to commercial reality. And now the talk of it going on sale in six basic colors, just like Tesla's cars, has ignited a wave of excitement. Priced around $45,000. The humanoid robot could soon become one of Tesla's most transformative products. Imagine being able to choose your robot in colors ranging from sleek white to matte black. Silver, blue, or even red teach, designed to match Tesla's futuristic aesthetic. But more than appearances, what really captures attention is how rapidly the project is evolving. Musk clearly refuses to slow down, especially with Chinese robotics companies demonstrating humanoid robots that can already backflip, play ping pong, and even box. In response, Musk recently posted a new demo video showing Optimus practicing kung fu giving the world its first glimpse of just how agile and capable the robot is becoming. He also hinted that the upcoming Optimus Gen 3, expected later this year, will be a dramatic leap forward. Tesla aims to create a robot that can cook, clean, and take care of people in their homes, transforming the way humans live and work. It's both thrilling and risky, as this could easily be Musk's biggest gamble since SpaceX. If successful, Optimus could generate profits that dwarf those from Tesla's electric vehicles. But if it fails to perform reliably, the consequences could be severe. Potentially shaking investor confidence and even endangering Tesla's financial stability. Developing a humanoid robot that can handle real-world tasks safely and independently is far more complex than building cars, rockets, or solar panels. It's one of the toughest engineering challenges Musk has ever attempted perhaps only second to SpaceX's. Starship Project. The newly released demo video showed something few expected. Optimus performing martial arts with smooth, precise movements that resembled human motion rather than robotic stiffness. Unlike earlier awkward dancing demos, this display felt polished and confident. The robot's movements were faster, more natural, and more balanced, suggesting significant mechanical and software improvements. Musk emphasized that this was not a tele-operated or computer-generated sequence it was fully AI-driven and recorded directly on his phone. This authenticity made the video far more impressive, marking a major milestone for Tesla's robotics division. According to members of the Optimus development team, the Kung Fu performance was achieved through a blend of advanced motion capture and reinforcement learning, allowing the robot to adapt in real time. During the demonstration, the robot responded instinctively when pushed by a trainer, demonstrating a kind of artificial muscle memory that allowed it to maintain stability under pressure. To ensure safety, Tesla used a suspension system and emergency stop protocols to prevent damage or injury if the robot lost balance. What stood out most was the speed of the actuator's mechanical systems that control the robot's movements. Previously, Many experts doubted that Optimus could ever reach such responsiveness, but the video proved otherwise. Each motion flowed into the next, resembling a martial arts kata sequence where every punch, block, and stance was pre-trained but dynamically executed. Some analysts believe Tesla's AI engineers have adopted a strategy similar to how gaming engines like Unity train AI models, using pre-learned action sequences that the system recalls and adjusts based on environmental feedback while this current version may rely on pre-programmed routines for safety. Future versions are expected to act autonomously, learning and adapting on their own without human intervention. Tesla's VP of Autonomy, Ashok Elizwami, who oversees both the full self-driving FSD and Optimus programs, reshared Musk's post with the comment, just the beginning. Once the AI models for self-driving and Optimus unify, it's going to be fire. This statement revealed Tesla's ultimate goal to merge the AI brains behind autonomous vehicles and humanoid robots into one powerful system capable of learning across domains. Once that integration happens, both Tesla cars and robots could share knowledge and improvements instantly, allowing exponential scaling. Just like a self-driving car constantly monitors its surroundings to avoid hazards, Optimus will eventually interpret visual data to make decisions in real time. Reacting to obstacles, human gestures, or unexpected events. However, despite the impressive Kung Fu display, it's clear the demo was carefully choreographed before being pushed.
both Optimus and the trainer paused briefly to ensure synchronization and safety. The beginning and ending gestures also resembled martial arts etiquette rather than spontaneous interaction, indicating a structured exercise. Tesla clarified that this demonstration was not meant to suggest Optimus would ever be used as a combat robot. Instead, it showcased flexibility, stability, and agility key foundations for future household and industrial tasks. Some critics compared it unfavorably to China's Unitree G1 robot, which can take heavy blows and recover without any suspension cables, even performing self-riding maneuvers using built-in thrusters. However, Tesla's use of cables appears more like a precautionary measure than a dependency, ensuring the robot's safety during high-risk testing. In reality, balance and precision are far more important than theatrics because no one wants to buy a robot that looks impressive but can't perform practical tasks. The goal behind Tesla bot remains clear, to create a humanoid machine that can function seamlessly in human environments. Whether it's cooking, cleaning, or caregiving, balance and coordination are crucial. Just imagine a robot serving a drink. If it stumbles or drops the glass, it becomes useless and potentially dangerous. This is why Tesla places immense emphasis on fine-tuning Optimus sensory feedback and motion control algorithms. The ability to recover from imbalance with small hops or quick backward steps isn't just for show. It's a vital safety mechanism. Musk envisions a future where Optimus can learn from videos just like a human does. If the robot can watch an instructional clip on YouTube and then replicate the action accurately, it would represent a monumental leap in AI capability. It would mean that instead of being programmed for each task, Optimus could learn anything cooking, cleaning, or even assembling furniture by observing demonstrations. This kind of visual learning could make it the first truly universal robot capable of adapting to endless situations. Imagine millions of Tesla bots worldwide continuously learning from one another in real time. When one learns how to fry an egg in Texas, every other optimist from California to Berlin would instantly gain that knowledge. This networked intelligence would form a kind of global AI memory evolving faster than any human educational system ever could. Cooking, in particular, is the ultimate test for humanoid dexterity and perception. Unlike factory assembly lines or cleaning floors tasks that are repetitive and predictable cooking, involves constant judgment, adaptability, and precision. From identifying ingredients in a fridge, to cracking an egg gently, controlling heat levels, and handling utensils. Each step demands multiple layers of decision-making. Optimus must grip with the right pressure, respond to visual feedback, detect heat, adjust movements instantly to avoid accidents. The challenge is amplified by the fact that every kitchen layout is different. Stoves, utensils, and storage vary from one home to another. Success in such a chaotic environment would prove that the robot's intelligence is flexible and context-aware. Not just reliant on rigid code, if Tesla achieves that, it will represent a breakthrough in robotics. Optimus will no longer be an experimental prototype, but a genuine household assistant. When Musk first unveiled the Tesla bot concept at AI Day 2021, many dismissed it as a publicity stunt, especially after seeing a person in a spandex suit pretending to be a robot. But only a few years later, Optimus Gen 2 has already been shown folding clothes sorting parts in Tesla factories, and gently holding fragile objects like eggs. The evolution from concept to functioning prototype has been remarkably fast. Highlighting Tesla's aggressive approach to AI-driven engineering, now, as Optimus approaches real-world deployment, people are beginning to imagine what it might mean to have one in their homes. Now, here's part two, continuation to reach approximately 21,000 characters. What fascinates people most about Optimus isn't just its industrial potential, but how it could transform everyday life at home. A humanoid robot capable of handling household chores could revolutionize living standards by reducing the burden of repetitive tasks. Think of how much time people spend cleaning, cooking, organizing, or caring for dependents. Optimus could take on all those jobs effortlessly leaving humans with more freedom for creativity and relaxation. Existing smart home robots like robotic vacuums help a little, but they're limited to specific environments 
and rely on fixed navigation maps. Optimus, with its human-like body, dexterous hands, and advanced perception, could navigate cluttered spaces, move furniture, wipe surfaces, or even tidy up toys. Unlike current robots that follow programmed routines, it could adapt in real time. Understanding instructions spoken naturally by its owner, Musk, envisions a future where every household has its own robot buddy, a machine that not only assists with chores, but also acts as a companion and helper. It could walk the dog, mow the lawn, read stories to children, and even provide tutoring. He has often spoken about Optimus' potential in education.